This is the river rescue robot, giving people who enter the water here in Athlone a fighting chance of survival. The robotic life buoy is remote controlled from the shore, and Gardaí in the town were part of a multi-agency training exercise today. The eventual goal is to have um, every Garda in Athlone station trained up in the use of this rescue robot and the other uh, rescue equipment. So, for so often the first responders, we have had two or three incidents in the last month alone. So um, we've had good outcomes, but a lot, a lot of times there isn't good outcomes. So this will give us a far better fighting chance. The Midlands town is the first in the country to use the high-tech life buoys, and it's hoped they'll give rescuers a head start while the RNLI lifeboat is deployed from outside town. That's the gap we wanted to fill. There's a 15-minute gap. If you're in the water here uh, on a winter's day or any day, uh, 15 minutes is a long time, and you'd be with the flow of the River Shannon, you'd be you'd be long gone. So we we fill that gap. Uh, and we're always in constant contact then with the RNLI and the Coast Guard. The robots will be stored in boxes on either side of the river. And people who are trained will have the combination code to open the yellow box. And for any of the public who want to access the yellow box in emergency, they may ring the Coast Guard 999 112 and they will also issue the number. While Gardaí are the first to learn how to use this robot, door staff in local pubs will be trained up as well. And Athlone River Safety Awareness is hoping to recruit at least another 30 volunteers to respond to emergencies. Laura Hogan, RTE News, Athlone.